Hi everybody, welcome to our channel, Anything Under the Sun. In today's video, we are going to show you how to put or add timestamps on YouTube video. If you're new to our channel, please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification bell below to notify you in our next video. How to put or add timestamps on YouTube video. Let's talk about first what is timestamps on YouTube video. A YouTube timestamp is a way to link to a specific moment in your video. Often, users will bounce or navigate away from video content if it is not what they are looking for. Here is an example of timestamps. What is the importance or benefits of timestamps on YouTube video? First, by adding a timestamp, you can improve retention by directing users to the most relevant portion of your video from the outset. Why? Because most YouTube users expect to consume video content in short segments. This is especially helpful for longer video. Second, not only do timestamps improve the viewer experience, but they also serve as a video SEO or search engine optimization hack since both YouTube and Google reward their use. Why? Because YouTube videos rank based off of audience watch time and audience retention. So, when a user clicks your timestamp, YouTube actually logs this as two views, once for the initial click on the video and once for the second click to the specific timestamp moment in the video. So, this 2 for 1 deal is a huge bonus that will help your video rank higher in search results over time. Likewise, Google is now also supporting timestamps. When a timestamp video is searched using Google, this is reflected in the SERP or Search Engine Results page. Results and users will be directed to a specific moment in the video. This helps visitors find the information they are after more quickly and boosts the value you provide to users. Below is an example of a timestamp video when searched using Google. Now, how to put or add timestamps on YouTube video. There are three main ways to add timestamps to your YouTube videos. First, manually appended to a URL. Second, via the YouTube share feature. And third, edit the video description. Let's talk about the first one, manually appended to a URL. For this method, Simply add the timestamp code to the end of your video URL for a specific video time. Remember, for YouTube URLs that already have a question mark, you need to use and t equals to indicate the timestamp. For URLs that do not include a question mark, you need to add that question mark in and use question mark t equals to indicate the timestamp. And then, you can specify time by seconds, minutes, and hours. Example Here's how it looks in practice. Here is the original URL. The next one is the time-stamped URL. Now, let's talk about the second one, timestamp via the YouTube Share feature. You can also add a timestamp using YouTube's embedded share tool. To do this, simply open your video and navigate to the precise moment you want viewers to start at. Stop the video and click the share icon on the toolbar. In the share pop-up, click the start at box and adjust the time if needed. Here's how it works. Then, all you need to do is copy the updated URL or use the tool to share the timestamp video to your destination platform or contact. Mm -hmm. 
the last but not the least the third one edit the video description in this method simply write your timestamps into the video description this is the easiest method we can do to add timestamps to our video and now we will show you how to do it let's start this video has no timestamps yet Below is an example of a timestamp description that we added to our video. Let's begin how to put or add timestamps on YouTube video by editing the video description. First, we have to open your video and find the precise moment you want viewers to jump to. To do this, we have to go first to Google Chrome and sign in to your YouTube account. Then set to desktop site, tap profile picture and select YouTube Studio. When you're in YouTube Studio, just tap Videos and go to Specific Video and tap to Edit. Then, click edit or pen button and then write the time into the description, preferably with the description. Before going to YouTube Studio, please take note of the specific time and description that you want your viewers to jump to.
This is a great way to add chapters to your video and help users navigate to the portions they are most interested in. One more thing, remember to separate seconds, minutes, and hours with a colon. If done, click Save. Let's check it out! Hi everybody! Welcome to our channel, Anything Under the Sun. What will you do if you cannot? Just tap the description on the screen and you will see this. Let's tap or click all the timestamps in the video. And you will see the added timestamps on your video. We're done. Thank you for watching and God bless. See you next time.